Hi guys, we are back again, Charlie. And if it's your first time on my YouTube channel, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to share with your friends. So, guys, if you follow me on Instagram, you realize that I do commercial. I am also a commercial model. I do commercials, billboard, um, radio, um, magazines. I found myself in a town called Setchery. And in Setchery, it's, it's also a town called Sim Simbiso. So it's about three hours from Accra. And the commercial has got to do with a cocoa farm. And so whilst here, why not vlog the cocoa farm and how the process in um, obtaining the, the chocolates you've always loved. And so let's see how it goes. Let's see the process. Let's see the cocoa beans, how they are dried, how they are harvested from the cocoa plant and so yeah that's 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 basically this video usually when shooting a commercial you're not supposed to show the brand until the commercial is out so i would skip the details of this commercial until the video is out so for now let's see the cocoa farm let's see let's see everything about having your favorite chocolate even though i don't eat chocolate i know you all love chocolate right <laughs> So yeah, let's go guys. You got to let it go. 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 There is literally no network here. I'm not alone though. I'm here with other crew. I'm here with the agency that brought me, that gave me this gig. I'm also here with a group of videographers, photographers. So we are quite a number of us. We came with three buses and yeah, I'm walking in the cocoa farm. Okay, I'm, I'm heading towards the cocoa farm. I can see other plants behind me and I'm glowing guys. The sun is giving me life. <laughs> it's a rural setting. That's why I have my natural hair on. So ghana is one of the leading cocoa producers in africa and it's one of the major source of foreign exchange for ghana so we can say cocoa is the backbone of the ghanaian economy i will say cocoa takes patience because it takes about three to five years before the tree starts to bear fruits Pod. No, this one is like good. It's a good pod. Sure. Okay, there's another one here. Come and see. It looks nice. Yeah, it's getting ripe. Yeah. And look, there are a lot of ants on the, the, on tree. the tree. Yeah. Okay. It's a very big, large cocoa farm. And this is how the cocoa looks like. This looks ripe. You won't see anything. So he helped me cut one of the cocoa. Even though I don't eat chocolate, can you imagine? I'm eating cocoa. <laughs> So you just have to lick the mucilage out of the beans and and that's it. So good. So there's more. Hmm. This is a close shot of the cocoa. And you just pick this lick the mucilage out of the cocoa that is if you want to eat it
before the cocoa bean is exported, it's dried for a week or more, depending on the weather, and it's packed in sacks before it's exported. I don't eat chocolate, but funny enough, the tasting this doesn't taste like chocolate. It tastes like um, a fruit. When I say fruit, like... Um, have you guys had baoba before? I think that's how it tastes like. Have you had baoba before? Yeah, it tastes like baoba. Baoba's cup. Yeah. These are the flowers of the cocoa. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this vlog as much as I enjoyed recording this. See you in Accra. So, bye. I love you as always.